Notice that the half guard is exactly that. One of my legs is in and he has control of it. He doesn't have both legs around me. He has one leg under control. Typically the attack from here is in under his arm, cross facing, and my fight typically is to get the mount or to get side control. And I'm going to be fighting to get out of this. So what we're going to look at here is I believe that when I have the top position in the half guard, I have the position of authority. He needs to give me an answer. He needs to have two or three options that will do one or two things. Get him completely away from this or put him in a position where he ends up in a position of authority, the guard. Okay. So we're going to look at some of the tools that can be used, some of the techniques, some of the answers when you're in this position. You don't really want to stay below me, especially in a real fight, because this position can be used for striking, and you having one of my legs is not really going to help you too much. <clears throat> Here we go. Now, notice, like I say, one of my priorities here is to get into the full guard and not allow him this position of authority from where he will eventually work his way into the mount, okay, or into the side control. One of the easiest things, bring this knee in, one of the easiest things I can do if I don't have an underhook and I'm here is to take this elbow and drive it to the mat inside of his knee. Notice where that elbow went? Right here. Bang. Now, it's very difficult for him. So I've driven my right elbow, in this case, right next to his left knee. It's very difficult for him to fight the motion I'm about to do, which is out and sideways. You see that? Now, as I create that opening, I draw my inside right knee out, up against his left thigh, and I'm pushing and fighting. Notice how my left foot then comes up from wrapping his leg, it comes up and it posts on his hip. And my inner or my shin is pushing on, his, on the top of his thigh to help put me in this position where I can then draw him straight into the closed guard, which gives me the position of authority from where I can continue with other attacks or reversals. So one more time, he has the half guard position, he's driving, he's looking to get the mount or side control, which are both positions of authority that would put me at a disadvantage. So I want to stop that process. I want to get him in the full guard or get completely out of this half guard situation. One of the ways is to draw this right elbow, in this case, down to the mat on the inside of his left knee, push that knee out, drive my right knee out from the half guard position. I'm holding on to him here. It will help me to bring my left foot to his hip, pushing with my shin against his thigh, pushing with my foot against his hip, fighting for a closed guard. Okay. Now, we've got another option here. What?